119, left Yankee, right hotel, and hold short of four left, please. Left Yankee, right hotel, short four left, Delta 119. Six Fox, let me see the traffic short final for four left. Airflot, left Alpha, you can't stop, you gotta keep going. Hey guys, what is up? Alex here with the Hollow Herald, and today we are back once again. We're going to be going over an app called Hollow Flight. It's a really interesting application that gives you kind of a bird's eye view of various airports and airplanes in places like Hawaii or the French Riviera. This is a very exciting app, and we liked what we saw, so as always, let's go check it out. All right, guys, here we are inside Hollow Flight. And right off the beginning, we can choose between two locations, Hawaii or the French Riviera. So uh, let's, let's look at France here. Let's, let's pick the French Riviera. Uh, no, I would not like Welcome to, to HoloFlight, flight data visualization for HoloLens. Ooh. The app is currently loading the initial flight data and also scanning your room. You can help by looking around in your room. All right, so let's uh, scan. While scanning, it doesn't have the same little wave. It doesn't emit a little wave. I'm not sure the technical term for that, but it does scan. See that? It now knows that my table is right there. All right, so here they are. We have, and this is all in real time, which I think is very, very cool. So let's... uh like I said we can either pick between airplanes or between the airports so this green one right here let's we're gonna select that or we're gonna pick this one first see that air course and then we're gonna select that one see with the lighting right now see that little circle over it that means it's been selected so all the information from that airplane is right up here as soon as we click on the airplane eye see that so it's coming from the suit course airport and it's headed and it's headed to Paris that's pretty cool and it's going to arrive in an hour that, that's pretty cool where is it where'd it go oh there it is oh there's almost like a mid-air collision right there did you see that that was really close oh crap all right, let's select another one. This one is going to Mar Marseille. I really hope I'm pronouncing that right. From St. Catherine. I'm not sure where St. Catherine is. Oh, that's not going to get there for another eight hours. That's pretty far. It's currently descending, and it's doing 290 miles an hour. That's really cool. So, yeah, it's got stuff like altitude speed, status, whether it's ascending, descending, or just staying the same. Let's look at, uh, so here are all the flights right now going on around us. What's the IB, or this one right here? There it is. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Let's see if we can find it. No, oh, I can't find it. Oh, well. City jet. Turin. Wow. Over in Europe, they have a bunch of really hard airport names to pronounce. All right, so let's select an airport now. This one right there. So the 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 Gino Cristoforo Colombo Airport. Oh, Christopher Columbus Airport. That's cool. So it is 27 degrees Celsius, and uh, 300, it's blowing at 320 degrees. This is, so this is interesting. So all this along the French Riviera is available right now. And the same goes for Hawaii. All the major islands in Hawaii, you can watch the flights going to and from. And it's really, really interesting. And... The animation is really cool, just being able to to watch as the planes ascend and descend and take off. It's super cool. 
and really interesting to see where they're going, how long it's going to take. So I can imagine this, this can be very easily applied. You know, I feel like it'd be helpful to have an app like this and, you know, in, in, in a HoloLens in, in every airport. You know, I feel like air traffic controllers could really use this. They could benefit from it. Maybe make things a little bit easier because all this is really like, I, I don't even know much about airplanes and stuff like that, but this is very, all seems very simple, very straightforward to me. All this important information about whichever airplane and, and all this is in real time, which is also very, very impressive. I, I, I really like this app. This is probably has to be one of my, my more favorite apps on the store right now. And I really hope that the developers can come up with a... Uh, can, can come up with, with more locations. This would be really exciting to see, like, over in... Uh, just like somewhere in Spain or in the United States, around big cities like in New York or, or Washington, D.C. This should be really cool. Super excited to see where they go with this because um, we forgot to mention before, this is only the, the beta version right now. So uh, I'm super excited to see what the finished version is going to be. So uh, hopefully that comes out soon. But they've, they've got me waiting for it. Alright guys, there you have it. That's Hollow Flight. I thought this was a very interesting app. You know, it was really cool to be able to see all the, the various information about all these apps. And I can imagine this would be very, very useful. I mean, obviously, I'm sure they have it already, but this is kind of a different way to access all of this information. You know, I wonder if it would help, you know, organization and stuff like that, if air traffic controllers were, were able to use this technology, like the HoloLens, be able to see everything literally from, from space almost. That, that's kind of the feeling that it gives. But obviously, this is a very cool app. It, it was also very entertaining just being able to watch the flights take off and, and watch them land. I, I love this app. I thought it was very, very interesting. So let us know what you think if you like it. How else could this be applied? Give us ideas. If you haven't already, like and subscribe down below. We appreciate your guys' help. Thank you so much. Take care.